Hello everyone, I'm James. How are you today? You can see today I got a new product that is called YA101 OBD2 Enhanced Code Scanner. It's a new design. I believe this is a, a kind of a basic code, uh, code reader, code scanner. So let's open it. Firstly, here we can got a quick start get. Uh, that is YA101 with some contents. You can read the user manual here. The basic operation details with uh, some spe specifications and some, you can see some manuals and some details information. Okay. This is a plastic box. And this is the main unit. This uh, is a can of the plastic, uh, plastic cover for protect the screen. So you can just move, move it. And this is up, down, back and OK button. OBD2 enhanced code scanner. It's gave me a very good feeling when you pressing the, the keys. Very good feeling, and this is a a kind of the rubber, the rubber, silicon rubber button, and with very good feeling. And this is a OBD2 cable with a full 16 pins inside. Okay, so let's get it uh, to the car, real car test. Okay, now it has this code scanner. The function first of all, we have to connect the OBD2 cable to the car OBD part and uh, switch ignition on to make the scanner working. Here you can see it's a color screen with a TFT color screen and uh, the screen perform very good. You can see from the any angle, the display is very clear. Okay, uh, this is the main menu. We choose the uh, diagnostic firstly. If this is the first time use, you have to do the loading and the protocol detecting. Right now it's the scan, scanning with the car with a, to detect it, which protocol. Okay, ISO protocol. And you can find uh, a summary information, MRL status, status, DTC count, something like that. Press back, we enter the uh, screen to read code, erase the code, lab data, let us do one by one. Read code. Read code. There is a stored code and pending code. No codes are stored in the module. Pending code. No pending codes. And we go to erase the code. Do you want to? Do you? Let me make the screen clear. Do you want to clear out of a code? It will clear out the. Machines, we choose yes. DTC have been cleared. Okay, we go to level data. It's a uh, need a little while to scan with uh, all the PIDs like Euro. Okay, here you can see the DTC, IL, off, flu system loading percentage, and uh, ECT temperature. And the next screen. RAM. And the vehicle speed, something. Okay, we press back. Freeze frame. No freeze frame data. Vehicle info. VN. You can read the V number. Collaboration ID. CVN and IPT in the different in information something. Uh, I'm Renee. Really nice. The shoes something like uh, the monitors, different monitor sectors to let you know if the car is uh, all the monitor working normally or not. Also mode six. 
you can see the model 6 value so this scanner is very powerful even you can read the model 6 information uh, in with, with this scanner okay CID test 2 test 3 for the model 6 you can read the, the basic value and you can uh, find out the maxi maximum and the maximum value to see if the current value is uh, between the both uh, value is okay or not ox to o2 sensor select module is not supported okay component test module not supported Okay, now it's a DTC lookup. The Genic. Code definition. If you want change, there is a PCBU. Total is, uh, is a four. If you want, to, for example, P0002. Also, also, you can see here, it's very important. These are, uh, there is a possible causes in the new type of corner in which... So you can find out the the uh, DTC code by the code definition, not only for the definition, but also for the possible causes. Voltage test. Voltage tough. Stack to good. And option. Language. You can choose the language, Chinese, Germany, Spanish, French, Italian, Japan, Puerto Rico, Russia, and uh, Chinese traditional. And you can change the unit to from metric to English. And uh, self-test, display a cable or something. And about, there is a serial number with the release, release the date. Okay, after all, this scanner is uh, very powerful and uh, with almost uh, all the OBD2 functions and uh, for the, from the Model 1 to Model 10 uh, are included. And uh, after my review, I think this scanner, code scanner, is very powerful and uh, it's worthy to buy. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.